Well, so students over at Fort Hamilton High School in Brooklyn decided today was the day to walk into school and roll up their sleeves to get their vaccination. The vaccine site is one of several the DOE is opening up at summer rising sites all across the city. And News 12's Marilyn Buckley is in Bay Ridge to explain. Getting your COVID-19 shot just got a little easier. I was coming in for cheer and then I heard about it when I came inside. Veronica Anastasiadis is just one of several students at Fort Hamilton High School who decided to get vaccinated just down the hallway from cheer practice. This summer rising site is just one of 25 the DOE is offering vaccines at between now and August 13th. That's amazing. It makes it a lot easier for people who don't have the ability to go somewhere like the city. Some of her classmates and a neighbor who both are already vaccinated agree that having vaccines at this high school will make it more convenient for everyone. Do it right for yourself, but I don't know what's more right than giving yourself the most protection you possibly can. I think that's good enough. That, that's good for everybody that should get vaccinated. But even with the Delta variant spreading and hospitalizations on the rise, some students like Zayed Al-Gandali, who's a freshman here, says he's just not ready to roll up his sleeve just yet. I don't want to get vaccinated yet. It's like... It, feel, it feels like I'm being forced to get vaccinated. Vaccines started rolling out at 9 a.m. and you'll have until 6 p.m. both today and tomorrow and in the Bronx tomorrow and Wednesday. Students can get their shots at Herbert H. Lehman High School. Accessibility to vaccine sites Alexander Authred believes is key. It shows up and it's right there and it's convenient. The more things we can do to get more people vaccinated, the better. All minors looking to get vaccinated must have consent from one of their parents, either in person or over the phone. Schools Chancellor Misha Ross Porter is hoping that all students 12 and older are able to get their first dose by August 9th. That way, by the time they go back to school, they'll be fully vaccinated. In Bay Ridge, I'm Mary Lynn Buckley, News 12.